Hello and welcome to the Fed by Farmers podcast with me, Cammy Wilson. And me, Iona Murray. And we're straight into it this week because our guests are already here. Usually we do a little intro and Iona and I talk nonsense, <laughs> but we're going to talk Stay nonsense here. with you guys straight away here. So we have Cammy and Rachel Jackson, of course, world famous now, <laughs> thanks, thanks to this farming life. <laughs> How are you today? We're good. Good, we're thank really you. Good, really good, yeah. What, you're looking all very well dressed. What's on today? Uh, we're going out for a wee shindig in uh, Glasgow. Yeah, we're yeah. heading to the hill in the hydro tonight, so yeah. that'll oh, be a good nice. a good wee night out for us. Let our yeah. hair down. Sc- <laughs> Scottish folk music. Yes, yes yeah, definitely. Okay. Can I beat it? Yeah, so, good island music. <laughs> I would usually do a little intro and, and tell us a bit about yourselves and stuff like that, but well, since you're here yeah. and we're doing it this way now, yeah. tell me about who's going to go first. Tell me a bit about yourselves. When you go, Rachel, you can go first. Um, well, I'm Rachel Jackson now. It's hard to get used to a new name change. <laughs> um, so I am originally from the Isle of Tyree, so I'm an islander. Um, I was born and brought up there, and I moved over to Glasgow to study agriculture. Um, so I did that for a few years, and I now work for the department. Um, so I do pharmacy. <laughs> <laughs> I do pharmacy. I'm a good one. I'm a good one. I'm um, a good one. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> ah, we'll just call it 50. I that's know, right. that's <laughs> a, um, um, so yeah, that's what I do for my day job, but also um, do the running of our tenancy farm at Dunrod as well. So it's a constant juggling of plates, but it's it's good. I like good it. Good fun. And, and Dunrod, of course, now famous, this farm and life. Mm. We're going to talk a lot about that <laughs> in this podcast, and that's, that's kind of why you're here, because it's you're, wrapped oh, up yeah. now. Yeah, yeah and what, <laughs> everybody's desperate to know if you've got your 5,000 sheep yet. Oh, yeah. um, so and and we'll, we'll, we'll talk about that, but Cammy, what's a bit of your background? Uh, born in Lanarkshire, originally, uh, and then we had a, farm in, a family farm in Fife, right through my teenage years, and then um, through one thing or another, I wasn't able to keep going in the family farm, uh, it all got kind of split up, so... I ended up going out and being stockman and farm manager for a good few years and then thought, why am I doing all this work for other people? I can try and do it myself. So yep. And then met stole Rachel away at a Ayrshire Ayrsh- Ayrsh- dance. So it was actually an Ayrshire we met. A young farmer's dance. A young or? farmer's dance, yeah, eh? Yeah, okay. Young yeah, farmer's dating site. Yeah, oh, well, that's what that's what, <laughs> that's what these things are, eh? Yeah. Yeah, actually, uh, there yeah. is one now, muddy matches. Is it? Mm-hmm. Honestly. Mm-hmm. Is it working? You're not in that though, are you? No. <laughs> I draw the line there. Yeah, yeah. J- j- uh, just bumble still. Just bumble. We're, we're gonna bumble. do I, I own a single. She's right. she, she's on uh, yeah. Anybody? <laughs> She, she, she's on she's on Bumble and uh, we're, we're going to do a podcast like maybe that should be one of our midweek ones yeah. just yeah. Q&A going through oh, but let, let's go through a few messages yeah. oh that would be brilliant I, 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 I could uh, critique her Riz I think the kids call it <laughs> I definitely don't think they call it that no is it not Riz <laughs> I'm going what that. is Riz Riz it was the Oxford Dictionary or Collins Dictionary Word of the Year Right. 2023. Is it wow. even a word? Riz. What it does now. it mean? That is now. Uh, Riz <laughs> means your ability to attract the opposite sex. Quite poor. I think it's not necessarily <laughs> opposite sex. Yeah, I was going to say that. We, we're, very, yeah, we're, very, and... we're very woke on this podcast and we always correct ourselves. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so just watch yourselves. I know. So, yes, <laughs> the, the, it doesn't have to be the opposite sex. A, a partner, and it's your, like, if you've got Riz, you're like, how are you doing? Like, Joy for Friends Joy had Riz. Oh, That's okay. an example of Riz. That's, yeah. Right, it wasn't okay. really, it was pretty crap chat. But it worked. <laughs> it worked, but that was more because he was good looking. Like, you don't, yeah. there's, there's a scientific fact that you don't need Riz right. if you're really good looking. Right. Right. Your chat doesn't have to be that. Which I say to Iona if she needs Riz. <laughs> 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go, yeah. Excellent point. I, I always, in, in that category, just like a bit of both. She almost doesn't need it, but just a wee bit. It's like a 70 30 split. She'll be fine. So we'll, we will do a podcast uh, yeah. critique, critiquing oh, no. your Riz. Okay. And that would be brilliant. Iona's Riz, we'll call it. <laughs> but. but we, we will have a tangent on here. Uh, we do. So anyway, you did it the old school way. Is, was it Cammy worked up the courage to approach you and say, uh, how are you doing? Well, <laughs> no, it was actually Rachel uh, came to insult my trousers. He had salmon pink chinos on. Oh, so that's bold move. actually not get much better. No, no. it gets worse. Uh, he I don't own a set of jeans. Right. Oh, no, he doesn't. I've never seen him. The only jeans, jeans I've got are shoeing really? jeans, that's it. Well, I've uh, never yeah. seen him in a pair Really? Jeans. What do you wear day to day on the farm? Uh, either shoeing jeans or old chinos. Just Chino, comfort, Chino's just the comfort on your skin. Right. Chinos are comfortable. Oh, like right. I do get it, but I like I, like I have got quite into 
uh, Levi jeans. Oh, yeah. I used to always wear walking Old trousers. Uh, yeah, yeah, well, I, yeah. I like like walking, mm. and, you know, Pumping. quick drying. Yeah. yeah. And then I don't know why I just I, I, I was wearing a pair of jeans for a landlord shoot one day, mm. and I came home and went straight to work and got them dirty. And actually, true story, I've still not washed them. That, 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 <laughs> that, that, true story. Uh, these are clean because I was out last night in the land. I not so much. But, but those ones I wear every day in here, the light blue ones, I've, um, not, I've never washed them since I bought them. You know, how long ago are we talking? Oh, four months. Oh, but there's nothing worse when jeans get wet. That That is the issue. Yeah. When you're on the farm. No, I agree. Leggings. True. I agree. Yeah. And that was a good thing about the walking trousers. You didn't really need to worry about your leggings if there was just a shower. They would, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's they'd it. dry fast. Yeah, yeah. change your soaked. Yeah, it makes you so think. Nice. We're getting so deep. I wanted. I know to that's so deep, so quick. I didn't want this to get all emotional. Know, one of those things, I know, you know. About you know <laughs> let's, know. let's let's keep the emotion out of this and stay on to like some hard st- facts. To be on the stag, do that. You made everyone wear a bad word chinos. That's what they called it. A bad word? Chinos, yeah. Right. S H star T. That's what oh, they called it. Yes, okay, a bad word. <laughs> so, I, I know, good on I you, mate. Good on you. Good well, I don't know if you've got the buttons for that yet. Yeah, if I'm bleeping, I do actually have a bleep button. Um, I can't I, no, I can't see it <laughs> quick enough to find it. But it, it's, it's fine. It, you, you've bleeped yourself. So that's, <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's it. So, so bad chinos, right. Aye, okay. and, so and Stag do quite good. i tell you another issue I have. Lizzie and I aren't married for anyone that didn't know that. <laughs> part of it is because it's too expensive. Yeah. And part of it is because I can't face the blackening. Oh. Oh. To be fair, they never got me. <gasps> did they not? Never got my brother either. Mate, really? well done. Just How did you do it? Because we, we're really both. Quick. I panel <laughs> went really quick. <laughs> and because we're so involved with showing and sales and the bulk of our friends are as well. Uh-huh. So... I can't believe we they just ran out of time. Really? Yeah. 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 Tried to do the Yorkshire show, and then the other problem with you is you're kind of big lad. Uh, yeah. 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 A big fight. A lot of folk were like, "Are we really going to tackle this? Yeah, yeah. So, so yeah, they never got me. And, and I should explain for anyone that doesn't know a blackening is essentially it's quite hard to. Well, it's not that hard to explain. Basically, the, the best man and the groom will generally be abducted. <laughs> Stripped naked <laughs> and covered in every nasty thing they can find in the farm. Sheep cleanings. Yeah. yeah. Old clean, if it's lamb, oh. if it's springtime, it'll be oh. sour milk. Oh, so, yeah. uh, old tractor oil is the one. Yeah. The, the, the uh, barley fines. Yeah. Oh, uh, you don't you don't want to get uh, blackened in the summer either because nettles are prone. <gasps> yeah. Oh, oh no, I would draw the line oh, at yeah. nettles. Mm. But lassies get it now too. Yeah. 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 The cage. Equality. Do you know the cage? No. So it's, it's a cage. Funny, when I was talking about these things Cage earlier. with a seat in it. <laughs> and they walk you in it. And then blacken you in the cage. And then once you're done, you lift you by a forklift onto a flatbed trailer. Did Philip Schofield used to present that? Oh, that's Isn't there a show awful. that Philip Schofield used to do like that? No? Oh, maybe that was a cube. That was a cube. <laughs> sorry, sorry. Don't hate the parade around oh, town naked in the cube. <laughs> that is, just strap you to a low load on tractor and just take you in. Flatbed trailer and then go to the pub. That leave is class. You on it. Leave you on it. That is class. I don't like sad- any of that. It's sadistic, no. isn't it? Ah, yeah. Uh-huh. 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 Really I hate, yeah. Into it, don't they? yeah. And I yeah. hate people chasing me. Like I, I would hate the thought that they were coming after <laughs> me. Like I would rather just be like, yeah, just do it. Yeah, yeah. And most yeah. most people do. Just yeah. like, just to do fair, it. I had yeah. the sheep. The sheep and the cattle were running around the steading for a good three weeks because I was I had all the gates open. Oh, to give you a warning. And, and to oh, fair, in those three yeah. weeks, I never. Left the quad bike in the shed. It was sitting at the back door with the keys in it for three weeks, day and night. And I had my plans there. Uh, you had your, your checking that Unreal. Snapchat maps. Yeah, like, Snapchat honestly, maps. It's a killer like, for blackness. You're, li- you're, you're living like some like drug lord oh, that's yeah, fled yeah. to Spain. Oh, yeah, honestly, <laughs> you like, it's like you don't think <laughs> you'll be caught, but <laughs> just in case. Just in case I've got yeah. 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 <laughs> dug a tunnel. He's, he's got a panic room. I'm just being prepared. I love it. I love it. I'll need to rent like another office somewhere that nobody knows about. Yeah, and we'll just start working. From That's there, it. move Stop this it. studio. Yeah. People never know. <laughs> you never know that you Don't know. quite block in all the holes upstairs yet. Just keep a few that you can. Uh, yeah, can yeah, yeah. 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 Uh, Fed by Farmers is coming to you this week from a secret location, <laughs> <laughs> a, a secret bunker somewhere in Ayrshire. <laughs> uh, my wedding's only two weeks away. And then we can get back. I can get back to enjoying my life. <laughs> um, so no, that's interesting. It's that a good thing to cover blackening. Yeah. So yeah. You, you get through. You obviously had a fantastic wedding in Tyree that yeah. I wasn't invited to. That's fine. <laughs> A lot of we knew you were busy with embroidery and stuff. Mate, you've saved yeah. my blushes because I'd have had to decline. Absolutely. Know, you're you're, you're kind hearted souls. souls uh, but I saw the photos. It looked absolutely smashing. No. And you were telling us just before we started recording that the pub in Tyree did a year's takings. Yeah, in one night. In yeah. one night. Yeah, so that's mad. Yeah, they were. Which made up for all the broken chairs. and. There was a few. There was a 
there was few a few flat pack trailers um, getting chucked outside the door and yeah. door shut again and then party on. Oh yeah, yeah. no, Tyree genuinely didn't know what hit it. <laughs> <laughs> I am still actually recovering from, from the wedding. I love it. I love oh, it. They, they they do a music festival in Tyree. Yeah, yeah, so the, our wedding yeah. was actually right on top of where the music festival marquee would be. Yeah, we, oh, had, so it, we, had, yeah, it we had it right where the where the festival's held. Yeah. Um, just right in front of the beach. And because there's it's a funny. community hall right beside it, it was perfect just to have the marquee set up there. and Saved on thousands on toilets. <laughs> Getting that, that over was, to Tiny. That, that was my goal. I like it. <laughs> yeah. oh, save, save, yeah. money. Save, save money. No one wants stuff to pay it. to go to the toilet. It, it was good, obviously, we saw a bit in this family life of you getting ready for the wedding. I, I thought mm-hmm. it was really nice at the end, and we'll, we'll talk more about this, well, we're about to talk mm-hmm. about this family life, but at the end it was nice you did your own sort of vlogging style bits. Yeah. It's actually yeah. really nice. Yeah, yeah. I, yeah. I know a different wee um, spin to it, just our own wee. Yeah, yeah. the way they did it with a bit of pace and oh, like, that's it. they were summing up and it's you guys finally married and yeah. uh, your own wee video. Um, yeah. No, it was, it was good. But this farm and life, what's it like? <laughs> it's mental, isn't it? Mental. It has actually been mental. Like you just, it's been such a good experience. We're so glad we've done it. Like, I don't think, like our story's really been covered. Like new, new into farming, we've not had the luxury of succession. Like going into a farm that's mm. already set up, we are literally at the raw stage of farming. So I think, I think we're probably brave doing it. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Showing, show, showing all that looking back it just it gives that when you're just working away yourselves at it you don't realize how much you're doing like how much you're achieving mm. but looking back and it you're like we've actually done quite a lot um so no it's been it's been a whirlwind isn't yeah. it like it's just passing a blur but it's been it's been a long 11 months though yeah it's all it has a lot of work yeah. in it like it's not easy is it how many days do they film oh, it oh just depends. varied from one some days it was three days a week oh really so, okay Rachel works. Yeah. I work away two days a week. Mm-hmm. You're kind of having to plan everything. And it's quite hard to plan. Farming's quite hard to plan, especially with stock. Yeah. Yes. Oh, in that's advance. It. So it is quite hard to plan ahead for quite a while. Yeah. Because they want to know two, three weeks ahead oh. of time. And things are weather dependent. Oh, totally yeah. as well. Yeah. So like yeah. The plans oh. did change a lot. Like some days, we're like, well, we can't do that. The weather's. I think they did like, film yeah. the wettest days we've ever had. Oh, oh every single day they were. But they, then they used that clip. Every intro, oh, that like loading the thing. sheep into the trailer. Oh. Thing. Oh. Yeah, <laughs> I've never had a day loading sheep it, like it, that. Much. It's you. We're gonna get Beachy and Hetty in as well for an interview. Oh. So it's you with the canoe and Beachy. Uh, I've no water. Oh, yeah, <laughs> is that, is that what it was water. again? I've no the water. <laughs> oh, yeah. I've no water. Ah, yeah, it's that, it turns the water. Oh, it's with no water. With no water. We'll get them to recreate. I know he has to recreate oh, that. Aye. But yeah. I've never loaded sheep like it. Oh, I mean, we saw this did the trailer. Put sawdust in the top deck and the That was deck. just for this farming life though. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It was clean. It was clean sawdust for a change. Yeah, yeah. And uh, literally we went to load the hogs and it all washed out. There was none yeah. in it by the time we loaded the sheep. Oh, yeah. Yeah. So, so, like yeah. the water from the shed roof was literally just pouring down our backs. And Stephen, good oh. camera and shout out to Stephen. I shout out to Stephen. He <laughs> was okay. hiding in a shed. I yeah. She was even get wet. They were yeah. they were filming us from inside the shed. Yeah. yeah, and we we're yeah. like, yeah, we'll just get soaked here and just. <laughs> Stephen is a good guy, and he's he's moved on now to another yeah. job. Yes, so yeah, yeah. he'll be missed for that show because he, oh, he, he was really very good. very good. He knew he his job. Again. He knew the farms. It was good yeah. fun. Yeah. And, yeah, he knew it was good fun. he was uh, he actually made it for us at the start because yeah. he was just he knew exactly what because he'd done it so much had a bit of sense mm. bit around stock and stuff knew exactly where to be yeah. not okay. getting the road and just got on with just, it like yeah. he just he just totally ran with us like when we were on something he wasn't stopping like oh do you need to do this what which one he just knew keep he knew but just keep that moving that's yeah. when, when, it, when yeah. it happened and i think that's the best because that's where you capture all the the two bits like you're not like yeah. i mean you're stopping to think about it you're like you don't when you're farming you don't naturally just stop to think about it. you're just like right i need to go on and do this so um he was really good at just yeah. Um, Even just like when we were at bull sales, like turning the camera off because you knew there was like private conversations when we we're trying oh, to sell bulls and stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He, yeah. Just, he would just yeah. have yeah. a break for five minutes because he knew like, exactly like he would like hear the first line and then be like, yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. Just the camera down. Yeah, and that's, that's really that's, nice. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You didn't, it didn't feel invasive. No, like, not at all. Definitely didn't feel invasive with it. So hey, I'm just gonna quickly. I I know, put it down. That's perfect. Okay. Yes, Can't stop perfect. her looking at me. It's hard when you're gazing I'm good, I'm good. lovingly at you. I'm going to do this again. That means I can see in the edit where I've, I've done something that oh, I need to delete. Right, oh, okay. so you've not got the snap thing yet? Oh, brilliant. No, quite. Just take one. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah,
<laughs> no, it's but it may be. You two are basically actually. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, yeah. Like, <laughs> like, it's like everything that like, you say ends with every laugh. <laughs> no, but it's I infectious. Mean, we're funny. Aye, I know. It's infectious. Uh, it's infectious. It's infectious. <laughs> and, 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 it, and it makes people warm to you. And I uh, take it you, you have had very good reactions to it. Oh, oh. especially south. South of the border. Yeah. Is really? Unreal. Um, yeah. Like, I was at a sale yesterday, and the mental Welsh people that have watched it and seen it and come up, it's unbelievable. Oh, that's so nice. How do you find that? Is it on? Is well, yeah. The adults is fine. It's when, um, well, you'll know about it, Cammy. It's when little kids come up to you and just start shouting your name. Yeah. Aww. In the middle of something. <laughs> and then all of a sudden they'll go away and they'll come back with like five kids. No, yeah. but Cammy. Yeah. 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 I know. And you're like, it's so weird because you, you, we're just us. Like, we don't yeah. say anything different. Yeah. Like, we, uh -huh. We're just literally doing our normal day to day, and these folk are just so interested and so genuine. And I think that's what we found. Yeah. Folk have been oh, definitely. so nice. Like, to come up, like, I. Like I know myself, like I, I probably wouldn't go up to somebody and watch chat them, but they do, and it's so nice that they yeah. want to take an interest in their they're rooting for you, and you're yeah. like, this is this is. That's great. been the best thing about the whole yeah. thing is yeah. the amount of uh, good feedback. Yeah, like yeah. people oh, are rooting for you because I mean, farming is bitchy. Well, yeah, it's, yeah. I, yeah. I always see in one, a way, you know, like I, I obviously similar to myself, we get a lot of good feedback, like yeah. great yeah. stuff. But one great thing with fa with farmers is as much as they can be a bit like that. They, they generally don't say it to your face. No, no, that's so, it. So, that's so, it. So, so, so all you hear is the good stuff. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So oh, makes you think, oh, it's like, great. Oh, it's everybody, lo everybody loves the sheep game. I know. It's so oh, no, true, though. But it is so true. It's been amazing. Like as soon as you go south of the border to mm. Wales and England, when we were at the shows, they, they just like love it because it's they're seeing parts of the country they've not seen before. I yeah. think as well. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's, that's, that's it's the most yeah. the best bit about it. Yeah, because that's all. That's all. We're, They're good. That's for what we watch it for. We want to see whatever people oh, are doing on their farm. Well, we all yeah. just we all just watch it for yeah. Yeah. Uh, that and Aussie. Like, like, yeah, yeah, and, yeah and, literally. And, so we've seen a bit of country, the countryside as well. I mean, like uh, up in the Hebrides, the Hebridean oh, cowgirl yeah. hash uh, at Instagram. Uh, great lass, uh, carry on. Like, yeah, they're brilliant. Yeah, that was they're, great scenic stuff. Yeah, yeah. Like, amazing. They need to get some holiday pods on that island. Oh, definitely. Mm -hmm. That would be a, a great. I think they're building them. Are they? Oh, I think good. so. Get I think that right. was mentioned at one point. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. They would. They'll, they'll do well off that. Oh, mm -hmm. oh. Have you had a meet up with everybody from the show? We yeah, we had a night in Glasgow. Yeah. Oh, oh that was the night to make yeah. up for the previous season too, was it? The, the, do you have both seasons together? No, no we just, just had the, uh, they were going to try and do something like that. Um, it was actually Stephen who was going to organise that. Right. And he then left. you left and thought, yeah. oh well. Yeah, I'm, not like, bugger, I'm not going to bother. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> delete, delete my number. I know. Yeah. <laughs> not my problem. No, we had, not a, little, my uh, problem. We had a preview in Glasgow. Yeah, that was For really the first good. episode that we were, us and Beaches went on it, so then they played like a wee, a wee snippet of the, a wee next, snippet of the next episode on it. Okay. And then me and Beachy went to the town. All oh, right, okay. Yeah. 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 Rachel and Hetty went to bed, they were knackered. So. <laughs> <laughs> uh, keep, keep you boys going, that's yeah. what it is. Yeah, <laughs> nobody's easy to keep up with Beachy. No. no. <laughs> he's fit for it. It's definitely not. <laughs> yes, he's fit for it. And, you know, with, with these things, uh, and you have no control over the edit. Yeah. No, always always a terrifying thing. Yeah. Honestly, that's it. You just genuinely mm. don't know what's coming. Like, we're sitting putting on, we're like, what are they actually going to show? Yeah. They, they take so much, they do so much filming, and you're like, you forget what you filmed and what you've said Absolutely. and you're like, oh, what story are they going to pull in? So that's a bit of a scary side of it. Oh, it would terrify me and a lot of farmers. So yeah. You need mm -hmm. to be brave. Oh, yeah. you do. You absolutely to do. do. And that's one thing that we we do say to folk, like you genuinely don't have any control over. No. Like over we, see, we see exactly what, is, what is. is coming on the telly the same time as everyone else sees it. <laughs> like we do not yeah, have well, you're no just clue. sitting at home is the first time you see it. The but first the time first we see time. it, yeah. And then you're getting the running commentary from everybody else that's watched it, like messaging you saying uh, this, and we're like, we're, all, we're just seeing it as well, yeah. Yeah. ourselves. So it's, and and yeah. you must have something negative to say about it. <laughs> like something to, apart, well, tell, tell me about these 5,000 sheep we're going to put in drum rod. <laughs> oh, no, yeah. Gonna, we gonna, better address that. We're, we're going to put 50 sheep on one acre. Room. No, yeah. um, <laughs> no there's, that is the only thing. Like you, they take snippets of little things you say, like ambitions, goals, mm. and then make it sound like it's going to happen there. And then like we we are probably at our numbers at Dunrod or where we want to be, but we would like to get to 5,000 sheep. Yeah, that is oh, a goal. Oh, totally. But I knew watching but that and knowing you. Yeah, that's it. Yeah. 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 You, 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 that's but it. But it was, it was definitely spun the way that, like, you're hoping to get 5,000. Crammed uh, and done rod. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and, and, and like, I always remember, and there's various examples of that throughout the seasons uh, with this farming life. And it's a great show. I'm not yeah. bashing yeah. it at all. Yeah. I just know how that, TV oh, works. It and, totally. and, and it's 
the editor doesn't really know farming. No, that's no. the thing. They yeah, just pull so they're, they're yeah. doing yeah. their best. That's yeah. it. They're pulling in what they think is... Like, it goes to editing in Glasgow, and then it goes to further editing mm. in London. Yeah. So, yeah. It's, so, so, it's, so it's so removed. Like, yeah. Of course it is. Yeah. I, I, I do really think they should, like, if I was giving them some advice, have a farmer as, like, a... A, some sort of producer yeah. or whatever the title is to review things and, and look yeah. at things and say take that out That's if they are listening no. Cammy is looking for another job there yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'll do it I'll do it yeah, yeah, I mean, yeah, great, yeah, like, yeah, great example is like there's a shot of your field and there's sheep everywhere in the field and they're just following the lame one. Oh, oh. I mean honestly it's we're things one like lame that. sheep in this oh we, all, God, we all get lame no. sheep yeah, yeah. we all get lame yeah. sheep they had, but they had more than one lame one but uh, yeah. come on <laughs> nobody's just get one no, lame one no exactly but you don't have they're not all lame as the thing but it just it just seems to Oh, and then they just cut, keep cutting back to it. Yeah, and and I was like, like, I'm like, of all the, the lovely sheep, sheep that they, you've got they, to they, take. They did it with, with Beachy and Hetty as, as well, well. The ones in the shed. I know. Yeah. You're like, of all the ones to film in, like, just, you've got plenty there. Just get a nice wee shot, but no. And that's the one thing folk are going to pick up on. Like, Absolutely. it's just yeah, like, yeah. Of things oh, that they're not going to see the whole rest of the beautiful scene. They're going to be like, that's a lame sheep there. Yeah. 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 And it's just, it's just the one of these things. And it's real. Yeah. It's real in farmers. Anybody that says they don't have lame sheep is. Yeah, blatantly oh, not. <laughs> 100%. And like yeah. farmers watching it actually makes them feel a bit better. Oh, like it makes it. me feel better. Oh, I know, oh, well, that's it. Because I'm like, oh, well, that's good. It's not I just me. I know, that's it. That's it. I know. It's just things like that that you think if that was, I just say if that was someone from farming that was doing that, they would know. Yeah, like, you'd like yeah. chop that. Yeah. Uh-huh, just be like, we don't need to be zooming in on that. Yeah. Like, yeah. Make that a whole. Well, well, there was the thing previously with Emma Gray, um, and we'll get Emma and Ewan in to speak. Emma and Ewan, when they moved from. Father Lee's oh, I think, yeah. uh, Northumberland, in Northumberland. Yeah. On the day they moved, they had a cow calf. Oh, yeah. gosh. And all of us watching that are like, oh, oh don't, oh, know, don't, don't show this, don't show this. It. Don't do it. But like, the film crew's there. I know, what do you like, do? She, she's got to get on with the job. And they did, and then they put the whole thing on. And it's like, and it, it caused them some issues. And, and it's all sorted now, of course. And, and Emma and, and, and you will speak about it quite freely. We're going to yeah. get them in, of course. Yeah. They'll speak about it quite freely. But it did cause them some issues. Yeah. Yeah. Whereas if you had a farmer watching that, they'd have said, oh, uh-huh. Yeah. You would absolutely yeah. would see that and be like, that's a no, that is a no. Yeah. Like, yeah. And it's just things like that, which, as you say, would be good to have somebody there just to filter out the, the yeah. things. And I think it's good for anyone uh, potentially going into the next season Yeah, to, to bear in mind. Oh, yeah. definitely. Like we did, we did, there were some things we just didn't show them mm-hmm. because mm-hmm. not that we didn't want people to see it, but we just thought, well, that's something you probably wouldn't want to put on telly. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Some things you were doing, okay. some yeah. things with vets and stuff. Tell, we us, just, tell, us, we tell us something you did. <laughs> tell us something you did that wasn't suitable for TV. I don't know. I'm just. I'm not a big fan of skin lambs because I'm not very good at it on telly. Uh, oh, yeah. Okay. So yeah. I just didn't want to do stuff like that. that. Yeah, yeah. Well, yeah. Funny. I, it can come across quite. It's amazing how you can get a sheep to take another lamb. Absolutely. Just with skin on it for a day. Yeah, but that's like, it. Whenever yeah. I do, when I'm doing my lambing videos, yeah. I never show the skin in part. Yeah. yeah. I just show, I'll show the dead the lamb, lamb, I'll say, yep. I'm about to skin this yeah, lamb. And then Next it, thing you see the skin on the lamb. Because yeah. nobody really needs to see it. No, no. not and at no, all. And it's brutal. Does it is, and does anybody really want to see that? No. I, I no. really want to see it. Like, as a farmer, you yeah. really want to see it. No. I like, imagine definitely. someone just flicking through the telly and that's all they see. The first I, thing you see in the telly is they're flicking through a program. I know, yeah. It's like things like that. Like, we just thought that's not. Yeah. Something that people need to see. All farmers know what happens. That's mm-hmm. it. It's part part so, of it. Like yeah, yeah. And folk get the just anyway. Yeah. yeah. No. Mm-hmm. And and for the next season, in fact, let's give it. Let's all have an answer for this. Okay. Who would you like to see on the next season of this farming life? Oh, that's a. I don't know. Oh come on! Look, I think of the folk you show with. It's always the same. Oh. See when you get asked a question that's on the it. spot. Oh. But then when you're speaking to folk, okay, Iona, that's you. Really good. <laughs> Look, are you even thinking about an answer yet? Have you got an answer? <laughs> no. I honour your dad. That would be funny. Yeah. My dad. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. John Murray. <laughs> get a dad on it. Yeah. Yeah, uh, yeah absolutely. Yeah. Well, have we had? Uh, I'm trying to think if we had a blackie. No. Have we had a no. top blackie breeder on it? No. No. Too many, We're secret, gonna too many the secrets stuff. in the blackie world to be put on telly. <laughs> Mate, get that. me on it. I'll, 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 I'll. <laughs> cut, cut that. Cut that. Cut that. We'll get cancelled. Oh, sorry. Um, uh, forgot yeah, we're in the I, I don't know. I'm just a commercial sheep farmer. I do not know anything about that. I own a stand your ground here. I know. <laughs> I'm an open book. I mean, I don't like anything. I don't know. I will get you. I love it. I love it. But who would you like to see on it? Um... I don't know, Cammy. I find it really intense when you ask a question like that. <laughs> <laughs> right, put you on the spot. No pressure. All these folk, you know, in farming. Who do you want to see on it? Oh, uh, He's been I, thinking about this for a while. <laughs> well, actually, I've, I've put a few names forward to the team. They, they usually email each year and ask for a few names. So I've, I've sent a few names through. I'm trying to remember what names I've sent now. 
Well, one I put through was James Nisbet. Oh, oh yeah, James, he would be hilarious. hilarious. Yeah, yeah, that's a good one. He would how old, right? That's a question for you. I don't know if you know the answer. Shout out to James, but uh, <laughs> how old do you think James is? Uh, well, he had his fortieth. He's forty-two or something. No, no, he's younger. He's under forty, is he not? <laughs> he had his fortieth, is he not? No, that was his. That was his party for when I know wife's got winter fair. That wasn't his forty. <laughs> so it was. <laughs> I was there, I did Tamar Shanter, that's Aye. right, I remember, I, I, I was thinking that was his 40th. No, that was his, uh, oh, that was that was his winning. winning party. So, right, okay, there we go, this is, uh, <laughs> everybody listening who's no idea that James Nisbet is just tuning off right now, but, uh, <laughs> let's see, we'll probably probably but the, this, the but... video podcast, I will have a picture of his face on right now. Cameron is the best shearer I have ever seen. Every sheep that comes off his trailer is perfectly shown. He really is amazing. James, can, oh, can should we do that again? He's, rent, he's under 40. Aye. Yeah. What age are you? Oh, Jesus. What age do you think I am? Oh! It's <laughs> a funny one. Did you ever smoke? Does he ever smoke? Yeah. He still smokes. Ah, I see. I think mm. that. Stress relief. You have, you've mm. got that kind of like, you probably look older than you are. Because <laughs> he <laughs> like smokes. <laughs> ah, well. Did you literally just from looking at him think he smoked? No, I think I knew he smoked. Yeah, <laughs> I was going to say oh. that is. Lovely. When he comes scanning, I'm back at the back of the scanner, smoking like a yeah. trailer, just trying to keep my nerves down. I had in my head that I thought he smokes, but I didn't want to assume. Like, okay, I couldn't okay. remember. <laughs> it's quite a real thing these days, actually. Yeah, it's getting rarer and rarer. Mm. Uh, so you're probably 35. <laughs> 31. No, mate, you're two years younger than me, yeah. and I look old. I know. Well, you thought I was seven years older than I am. I, I thought yeah. she was 33. <laughs> Tw- 20, 27. <laughs> Yeah. Which way do you? 28. 28. Oh, okay. 28. Exactly. Young yeah. tight, tight enough. Yeah. 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 A couple yeah. of years on you yet. Yeah. That's interesting. I know. Maybe not. I'm 35 now. <laughs> so, well, I think you know that. Oh, I know. No. Mate, what about this smoking? Aye. Oh. It's no good. Stress. Mm. Have you always Does smoked? Does it help? Uh, since about 18, 19. Mm. That's quite late. For mm. West of Scotland. Well, yeah. you're Atlanta, <laughs> yeah. Ayrshire, that's quite late. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> quite late on. Something must have happened in your life to start so late on. It's so unusual. Not actually that bad. Never used to smoke much. Smoke a wee bit more now than I probably used to. How many? Oh, under 20 a day. Right, so we're saying a packet a day? Mm-hmm. No, under a packet. I always have some left for the morning. Okay. One okay. probably. Yeah, I like it. Or getting <laughs> the truth. <laughs> one snap, <laughs> one, well, I, one I, stubbed I, out. That's all Two draws. I know, quite a wee one that I <laughs> we, we, we used to have a thing at, at school that was, um, no, I, I never smoked, but there was, a, I mean, I've tried it, but I never actually like smoke smoked, but it used to be a thing you'd call it um, leave us twos. Did you ever? Oh. Oh, you, you would be too, at 18, you wouldn't do that no, with someone. No, definitely not. Yeah, you could buy no. your own fags, but so, this is 14 people, year olds. You could be out in a night out and someone says, leave us two, and you're like, no, just have a fag. Yeah, yes, uh, yes. Okay. I'm not going to leave you. So what does it mean, like, leave two draws? Yeah, uh, pretty much. Right, okay. I, I, is it, no, I, I think it means leave us twos. I thought it meant leave us half of it. No, that's a bit greedy. Leave us twos. Well, uh, LDs, like two they used draws. to say, gays L, give us, it would say <laughs> gays LDs, which is like, give us LDs, which would be last draws. Right, okay. Wow. Know. So twos, I, I thought twos. I thought You're very clued up in this, Gary. Yeah, I was like, I've hung about with all these folk when I was younger, like, yeah. but I never actually smoked. It was, I always did sports and stuff, and it was not for me. But yeah, they would do it, and it used to be like a pound a fag or something they would buy them. Somebody would buy a pack oh, and sell them. I think so. I'm I mega deal now. How, well, I was going to say, how much is a pack of fags? Uh, it's about 12 pounds. No, it's not. And yeah. how much would you right. say? 12 pounds yeah. a you know day. What annoyed me? I brought some back from, we were just on our honeymoon, I brought some back, <laughs> and it annoyed me. Four pounds a packet. Four euros a packet. So that's not even four pounds. Where from? Uh, Cyprus. Shout out to the Cypriots. Yeah. <laughs> Seen a couple of sheep fags out there. I was buzzing. <laughs> cheap fags. Love it. Uh, and are they, are they just the same? Are these not these dodgy yeah. ones? No, no. Exact I, same. You've been coughing like a God knows what since you came back from the night you're So you don't think they are the same? No, they're no, not the they same. Are. Not as good. No, I no, said they so don't have the same cheap. safety. Uh, no, they wouldn't yeah. have. No, exact that same. Cheap. It's just different packaging. But, well, even, do you know what? I actually don't mind if the government's taking eight pound per packet for themselves. I'm all for that. <laughs> exactly. And now they're trying to stop it. What are they going to get the money from? Yeah, that yeah. does seem crazy. I thought that as soon as they announced that. I was like, yeah. I'm all for trying to stop people smoking. I would quite happy if I didn't start. <laughs> uh, but <laughs> where are they going to get the tax from? That's a mm, lot of money. Point. So you think we should be running some pro smoking ads? Oh, get back to it, yeah. Get into smoking. Yeah, get into taking smoking. ladies back in the packet again. Feeling stressed? <laughs> <laughs> Struggling to get 5,000 sheep on 100 acres? <laughs> Should be a right, right good answer. Smoking's for you. <laughs> Have you tried vaping like the kids? Horrendous for you. It's not good for you. 
Oh, I agree, but oh. I've seen both. I, I, ne- I nearly, both I tried it. Side. Nearly killed myself with it because mm-hmm. I didn't realise at the time I was lying on the floor, vaping away. Didn't realise the fluid's not good for you to go inside you, is it? The fluid. The fluid in it right. is very, very harmful. Okay. I'm not a big believer in vaping. You yes. know when you drive along <laughs> the roads at night, at like through. <laughs> Okay, Cammy. <laughs> what is? It's more no, harmful for you than va- smoking. No vaping. But no, then it's please. like they're all pushing. They were pushing, pushing, pushing for people to start vaping rather than smoking. And then you drive through towns now. All you see is little blue lights and little red lights, and it's all the vapes just been chucked on the ground. Oh, it's shocking! Like I'm so against it, and it's all advertised at kids. Yeah, yeah. yeah that's like all the wee thing. pink and oh, watermelon yeah. flavour. Oh, that's it. Don't be yeah. wrong. You, you walk past a, a cloud of vape vapor, and you're like. <laughs> Oh, that's well, oh, yeah, it's, smells like, I know that. <laughs> but it's like, it is, it's absolutely targeting the kids. I think yeah. they are going to crack down on that now. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, Apparently, I heard there's been a lot more fires in like waste places, and it's because of the, oh, the batteries, the batteries yeah. and the oh, vapes. Get wee batteries. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah. yeah. And you can't recycle them. No. Yeah. So that'll be like tons of batteries, yeah. like tons yeah, and tons. Just... Crack down on that. So uh, back to us at a farming topic then <laughs> and we, then can we do a non-farming i yeah. want to hear about the honeymoon we'd, 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 <laughs> yeah. We'd, oh yeah this is cyprus but we went to see sheep there so that's okay uh, yeah, yeah we okay. like to do it we do a little bit just to keep the name relevant uh, yeah. we'd, we'd, <laughs> a it. little bit of farming we don't really just talk about farming back to absolute nonsense yeah. after that um so in, in terms of the farming side of things it'd be interesting just actually the tenancy you're on yep how you came to get that uh, so t- tell us what kind of tenancy it is so we're, we're on a short-term tenancy mm-hmm. At the moment, um, so it's like a SLDT, yeah, yeah. Is, yeah, yeah. And what is short term? So it's anywhere from between like five to ten years. Okay, mm-hmm. um, is what a short term is known, and a long term tense is usually aimed at more than ten years, yep. okay. fifteen years. Yep. Rowan, but um, I think there's just uh, it's quite hard to get long term tense now. Oh yeah, oh yeah. yeah. Just yeah. there's so much, there's so much going on in farming, like in the government where. No one knows what's going to happen with schemes, yes. grants, mm-hmm. and, and where the that. money's going to be for yeah. them. And, yeah. and a lot of people are too scared to give out long term tenancies because they can think, well, I can make more money doing this in a different way. Yeah. yeah which yeah. is not fair on farmers, really. No, but that's it. No, it's but that, it's part of that has to go back onto the government for not coming forward and saying what's going to happen with subsidies, what's yes. going to be the next priority. Mm-hmm. I, if, well, it's, 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 I can be as opinionated as I like on here, I suppose. Uh, I mm. think what they'll do is you know, it'll be interesting to hear what you guys think about this. I think they'll just rebrand it all and keep it more or less the same. Mm. Why? Because I think I think they initially you know you're like mm, No, you I hear, genuinely don't. If you hear get, it, break yeah, it. I here. know, I know. <laughs> Breaking news. No, I genuinely <laughs> don't, <laughs> don't. <laughs> it's like, she's like, Oh, do you think so, Cammy? <laughs> <laughs> keep going. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> what else? What else do you think? Um, clown. Uh, so, so I think they'll, they'll, they'll end up doing that because I think what they initially planned to do yeah. was say to farmers, look how bad you are for the environment. Now, this is me just spouting nonsense, okay? But it's Unusual. my thoughts. It's not like me, <laughs> but it's my thoughts. I think they thought farm, farming was terrible for the environment. They've done all these grant-funded carbon audits and actually been, been like, well, wait a minute. Actually, most of these farms are like carbon neutral or negative yeah. or mm-hmm. are certainly very marginal based on the production they put out. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So we can't go after them for that. What are we going to do? And now they're sitting like, oh, what do we do? How do we, you know, make them go greener? And the only route they can really do that I can see is going to impact food production, which is so short-sighted yeah. in terms of, you know, the future of the world and the grown population and fallouts with other countries. You look what happened to Ukraine and we couldn't get the grain in and we still don't know how that's going to go. That yeah. It looks like it could still end up in the hands of, of Russia and they have the grain. So... That's a big impact on us. So look at the food security, and I think they'll just think, let's just rebrand it, change some of the paperwork, and and keep it going as it is. Oh, definitely, because they'll. I think they'll uh, end maybe up, drop it. They'll end up trying to get people to sell their carbon credits. That will happen. I think Which I happen. think is a farce because it's Absolutely. not. It we are anything. we are carbon neutral, but the people who are not are getting gifted the option just to buy out of it. Yeah. So like the, the Highland clearances at the moment is horrendous. It's all happening again. Through big companies just going and buying mm. big estates, farms, clearing all the shepherds off it, the gamekeepers off it. They're not even mm. having gamekeepers on it and they're just letting it go wild because it makes their company look good on paper. Yeah. When that's really so they're not. No, absolutely. Mm, yeah. And and no, that's it's all good stuff. Uh, not good stuff, but it's all a good point. Like it's it's happening so much. And yeah. it's 
the short sightedness of all these, you know, hills getting cleared. And there's places to put trees. We talk yes. about it all the time. Mm -hmm. Oh, definitely. Mm -hmm. There's places to put trees. But there has to be some. And another thing that we need to watch as well is foreign money. I don't think we have such a big issue here yet. I could be wrong. But I believe like in New Zealand, like there's a lot of Chinese multi-billion pound companies or yeah. dollars. I disagree with that because 90% of the vets in Britain are now owned by American companies. So there is, oh, it's already really? happening here. So it's already, all these corporate companies are all corporate investors, but most of them are American. Buying the estates? Buying the vets. Why are they doing the that? The vets? Mm -hmm. Most of our vets. So when you're vets... You're talking not, about a vet practice? Mm -hmm. Yeah. 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 Okay. Why are they doing that? Because it's an investment. You know, everyone needs a vet. It's like everyone needs a doctor. Everyone needs a small animal vet. It's like all those vet practices that are getting bought up, making, going corporate... We had Kaz on too soon. He was like, we need to get mm. Kaz back to say, like, come on. Maybe not. He's a small uh, independent practice mm. in Northumberland, so maybe not. But yeah, like, you, right, okay. Mm. That's how, like, we would rather support a vet, a vet practice that's owned by the vets. Mm. Okay. It's like the amount of vet practice you go into now. And you speak to vets, uh, and I was like, speak to a vet about it last week. Um, he says, there's more staff in the offices now than it is out on farms because there's big corporate people that have come in they're sending in like accountants mm -hmm. to run the vets that don't actually know, know how to run a vet. what's actually God, happening really it's like the price of vet drugs goes up uh, yeah that's interesting mm -hmm. yeah yeah, yeah they, they just bump the prices up to cover all these extra staff that they didn't yeah. need mm -hmm. yeah and they just turn it into this big beast of an organization Yay. yeah that's interesting mm -hmm. but that's foreign yeah, money that's that's buying that that could be a controversial <laughs> Let us know if you're a vet. You can be anonymous. Well, you can't really be anonymous, but <laughs> well, you can send us a letter. We'll put that <laughs> yeah, in. send a letter in. <laughs> we'll, we'll read it out. Faxes. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Show the handwriting. Some yeah. don't know who it is. Yeah. No, that is, yeah. I thought you were talking about the big shooting estate. I know of some shooting estates that are owned by American, rich Americans. Yeah. But it's, it, it is a worry for, like, as I say, I think New Zealand is a big issue. Chinese, mm -hmm. Although, you know, maybe legislation to cap that a little bit. Because you give up so much control when you start losing land mm. to, yeah. to foreign nationals yeah. like, without being too controversial. Although I was saying that in New Zealand when I was out there, the the farms that are owned by the Chinese, they all still employed, it was local managers. You know, they had okay. they had other people from other countries doing the day-to-day -day running of it, but it was locals that knew the ground, knew yeah, how to work the farms. I'm not, I'm not thinking so much about that. I'm not so, so much thinking about, like you're saying, um, or to do with people buying it and planting it in trees and yeah. doing this. I'm actually more thinking long term. Yeah. Oh, right, yeah. 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 Like, what, what happens? happens? Yeah. 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 What happens all of a sudden when 50% of the the farmland is owned by foreign yeah. uh, companies? Out with oh. the country. Mm -hmm. Out yeah. with the country. You yeah. know what I mean? It's, it's a great way, let's say for example, this is extreme, <laughs> extreme <laughs> nonsense I'm talking now, but I don't think it's too far-fetched. Maybe in my head, I'm just <laughs> I'm making this up as I speak here <laughs> and I'm worried already I shouldn't say this. But let's say, for example, New Zealand and an ally of China's uh, decide to fall out. Yeah. China just say, right, no crops in that 50%. All that land we own, we're not farming it this year. Do you know what I mean? Pool, yeah. pool production. Mm, all yeah. of a sudden, the food security of that country is uh, uh, you know, yeah. at risk. Yeah. yeah. And that's a great way to keep the country weak and stop them causing... No, New Zealand's not going to fall out with anyone I don't think that. <laughs> no <laughs> New Zealand's nice yeah. Yeah, good laugh isn't yeah, it? I, I, yeah. good, good laugh. laugh good laugh it's like the Aussies there was a there was a, it was a comedy show and uh, oh it was uh, I was watching something always sunny in Philadelphia and they were talking about the bad guy uh, in this uh, movie was Australian and they're like oh, it just doesn't work it like, doesn't work an Australian <laughs> bad nice. guy that's it's like, it. yeah, they're too nice everybody loves the Aussies too, that's it <laughs> do you that's know what I mean it. Yeah. Like, it used to be like Eastern European yeah, or, or yeah. some stereotype yeah, yeah like definitely they, they, they spoke about Die Hard you know like Hans the German you know, yeah, yeah, like yeah. That. that's it the Aussies are too nice to be bad guys oh, yeah I don't think I've ever met a bad guy bad Aussie <laughs> there you go no. even if they are they just come across just when they speak just sounds so, so nice. nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're just yeah. like dazed. <laughs> <laughs> no worries. No worries. I know, and, and now we're moving abroad and getting quickly away from me talking about New Zealand going to war with China. <laughs> <laughs> I was getting a panic there, what was going to come out of my mouth. <laughs> so was I. <laughs> <laughs> I, tell you. I, I wanna, like, you do your uh, off topic question. It's, I want to hear about the honeymoon. Oh, it was amazing. Hot. 
He's complaining that it's too, well, it wasn't too hot. We went to Cyprus, um, managed to get a week, managed to get him <gasps> away for a week. Did you um, go soon after the wedding? Um, so we went on the 1st of November. So we had a few months between wedding finishing and couldn't then the go honeymoon. After, couldn't go between top sales and bill sales. No, I'd be yeah. fitted I around that. Try, see, trying to get a date for this man, honestly, to go on holiday is an absolute nightmare. It's got to revolve around top sales, sales, shows and all that. So we finally got a week. Um, so we went to Cyprus um, and it was just amazing. It's just the difference of just going away, switching off and just like recharged. Um, and you did enjoy it. I did because I just went and hired all the boy toys like uh. jet skis, speedboats. <laughs> so we're doing that every day. Was, what, what's Cammy coming back with now? One day the jet ski, <laughs> speedboat, a buggy. You got a buggy uh, one got day. A buggy. Yeah. I just like a, a, CF moto, a CF buggy. Moto buggy. Yeah. Oh, was it actually yeah. CF Moto? It was. Shout out to Shout CF Moto, they're yeah. in Cyprus and as well. Cyprus. So we were using driving one of them round island and stuff. Ah, it's, for not, them. It's, a, it's not like I've got, it's like the fancy off road thing, is it? With the no, road no. cage? No, no, so no, it, exact same. Exactly. Oh, just exactly. Like yeah, yeah. just exactly. Cheaper version, no windows. Yeah. But it's Cyprus. But it's quite nice. Yeah. Yeah. It's quite nice to get the breeze. Yeah, you bake in the. Yeah, it actually would. Yeah, no, exact same. And, and did you, you said, mentioned about going to farms? No, well, we didn't yeah. go to farms as much as I well, would have loved to. We've seen <laughs> farms. So, but we've seen like uh, fattening farms, right, anyway, okay. which is completely different. It's just sheds. Yeah. Uh, flatted yeah. sheds. Yeah. Just, yeah. 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 There's a lot of Well, I don't even think there were slats. I think uh, it's yeah. just dirt. Uh, it's so dry. Eyes, mm. right? And they're just like wee paddocks. So it would be like the size of this room outside mm. them. Okay. So okay. mostly stock. We didn't, we couldn't really see much stock because they're all inside. At that yeah. time, yeah. it was so hot. Yeah. Yeah. Like they'll put them out in winter and bring them in through the summer. Okay. I'm so buzzing I'm getting to talk about stock in Cyprus. I know, I know, like, allowed to when I was actually there. Oh my goodness, see when we went to the tour of the island, that's all he was doing, he was like a kid at the side of the window, was like, and he sees sheep, and he sees cows. And see when he saw it that time, I was like, right, he'll enjoy the rest of the day now. He's he's seen what he's needed to see, that's it. Even like the ploughs, like single furrow ploughs. Is that right? Oh, uh, just like we we bit something down the hills. It was just stuff. like Turkey. Obviously, they kind of neighbour very yeah. close. Yeah. But like, yeah, Turkey. Like it was some mad thing where it must be like they all own wee small parcels of land. Yeah. Because the, the whole field could be ploughed, oh. but each bit in a different. It's different. Done by, done, yeah. yeah. So it's not like somebody just drove through and done one run. One, yeah. They've like, all they, got they've their done own. Done their own wee bit. Yeah. Like, you think you'd just say to your mate like, Aye, come on. I'll do it. You do this bit. I'll do that bit. Aye, yeah. Yeah. Split it up. Split the yeah. job off a bit. Like, Same with invoice. Aha. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> you know we'll I mean? sort it out. <laughs> They're like, no, this is my patch. I'll do it the way I want to. Like, it's obviously a thing. I would just feel so snide, like turning the the, the plow, and like, it's it's like when you see um, people who share a bit of grass on their drive, and they just cut oh, that cut line. Oh, cut a bit. Oh, and you're like, but come then, on. then there's the ones that take it really far, and there's like an inch or six inches in the middle that no one knows who owns. So nobody <laughs> cuts nobody, it. Nobody so it's just cuts like it. this little it's bit like of no rough grass land. in the middle. <laughs> Like I, rather than step onto their side, you just yeah. don't risk I just, it. I yeah. just don't risk it. I like it. That's it. A bleed zone. So no, Cyprus sounds good. I've never good. been. Uh, Went swam in the sea. Uh, yeah. The, the Black blue, Sea. Is blue it Lagoon. Oh, Not the Icelandic one. Uh, Not the chip uh, shop in Glasgow. I, I know so no. many folks say but that. But it like, is the same. It feels far. the same. As <laughs> like, the chip shop? No. <laughs> <laughs> Always a danger of getting stabbed. Right. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, no, it feels the same as the one in Iceland. Okay. They've also been to like that. But it's not sandy texture. Salty. Yeah, yeah, but it's like the, uh -huh, yeah. the sand and stuff in your feet's like the same. So blue. Although, like the one in Iceland's like there's a bit of hair in it, but yeah, there's so many people yeah. just have a yeah. bath into yeah. it. Yeah. And, and but it's not warm. It was pretty warm actually. Yeah. I, the heat because it was yeah, it was it like was... into November and it was still 28, 29 degrees. Right. Oh wow, we did. We got the weather. So it was, like, it was so... the hottest time they've ever had it that way at in that the season. Time of the year, right. yeah. But then that is the thing with farming; you have to actually go abroad to get any sort of break. Yeah. Don't yeah. you? Like, you actually have you to leave the country. Uh -huh, yeah, Takes you like three days to shut off, and then yeah. you've got like one day, and then the next <laughs> know, two days you're, you're thinking like, about going home and what needs to be done. I need to get back. Uh -huh. You're like back in town. So you get like what one day completely <laughs> off. <laughs> I'll just switch off. Yeah. 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 So and you're away getting a CF motor buggy. I know. See sheep. I know. To go and try yeah, and find sheep. Day off. Yeah, my day off. Go and find sheep. Must find sheep. There was. You could hire the CF motor quad bikes, but I was like, well, I've got one of them at home. It's basically you're doing a demo. It was like. I know. It's quite impressive. When, when the accountant sees it, what's this business expense <laughs> from, from Cyprus? It's like, well, that was out. business research. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I might buy one, yeah. <laughs> you see how you drive right around the main roads and all the time now? They're quite comfy. Yeah, oh, great. yeah they are. My, my, really. my pickup was in for uh, a service or something last week and it was in for two days because it was neither that all? done. Two days? Uh, I know, I did well, to be fair. <laughs> and uh, like, I just drove about in the, 
the buggy the whole time. Yeah. <laughs> like it's great. Yeah. Yeah. That's it. You can just get about. I didn't realise duct tape companies do services on cars. <laughs> 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 well, it still has all. It still has all the duct tape. Um, <laughs> it, it just needed new lights at the back that I smashed, power steering pipes. Uh, what else? All the filters changed, new brakes. <laughs> uh, I think that was it. It was no bad. But so the worst of it was people hadn't... don't realise the expenses in farming, like all that stuff. Mm. The cost, not. absolutely not, mate. And, and and that's why I don't get the paintwork fixed because that would just be astronomical. I know that <laughs> yeah. would be a big. Like, I just hope that someday, like something terrible, like accidentally goes in fire or something like that. <laughs> <I know>. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, I tell a joke. Oh, well, I can't. That's you not know if that I, happens. I can't, I can't. I know if it happens, <laughs> know, it'll know, just be memes. I mean, like. <laughs> But it's like a double, it's a, it's a double uh, con, isn't it? Because like, why would I say that if I was going to do it? Yeah. <laughs> the insurance company show you all this. Is there so a picture the with the window down with your face like that as it's on fire? <laughs> me, me running away. <laughs> me, me, me standing like with, with a burnt t-shirt yeah. going, yeah. can't you believe it? Stopping the fire engine getting through. I just came out of the house and it was like that. I know. I got here. Gutted. Eyebrows <laughs> burned off. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, no, don't play with petrol kids. No. Nah. Uh, dangerous but no it, it's done as well and yet and uh, i will give cf motor another shout out they sponsored the first four podcasts and ironically now they were, were with yourselves that mm. they're not but thank you very much to them for that and i'm sure we'll have them and back thank on you board for again. our quad bike it was very good mm. yes uh, there we go another endorsement of cf motor. of course we've seen that a lot and a beachy had one as well actually was it yourselves yeah, beachy. beachy's got two He's got two. Yep. Baller. Yeah. Nah, nah, that's, baller. Those, that's those store lambs. Nah, that's right. I'm going to, don't worry. <laughs> but I've already wound him up about that. But that was another example oh, of like no, a snippet. You mentioned it. making, yeah. like, he's obviously he's just, only in it for a pound yeah. and they've taken it like that's a general saying, you're only in it for a pound. Yeah. Yeah. Whereas yeah. they've oh. took it into, oh, he's only in, he's only making one pound a sheep. Yeah. Know, it's like exaggeration. Well, and it's like the t- 20 pound and I thought, they, they kept bringing that up, you know, about turning them over. And But I thought it was actually great yeah. with, that Beachy sat down with them at the end I know, and, and, that, that, and showed that, the figures oh, and said, oh, we, we, we made this. Definitely. Because usually this farming life, everybody makes a loss. Uh, yeah. oh. <laughs> no, that, that is, what, that is, that is, that is yeah. my biggest criticism of the show. Yeah, that's like, it. Like, why would anyone watch... Th- all right. And be encouraged. Yeah, but why would anyone watch this film? Yeah. Definitely, that's yeah. it. It's, it's yeah. always such a, like, uh-huh. oh, poor us. Because uh-huh, yeah. we, we only had, like, one criticism of the show is they were just, they want to push diversification. That is their main thing. Uh, and we were there and we were like, yeah. like we, Rachel does do her bacon and stuff like that, but um, not every farm can. is in a situation where they can diversify away from oh, farming. Yeah. It's sad. It, I, I saw a great post, actually, talking about diversification on farms. I thought it was great. It's like, isn't it sad that we can't just farm. That's yeah. it. Oh, honestly, all that's I want to do said, is farm. Yeah, yeah. That's what we said. It's like, that's and you have all to try we and want find to do. Somebody we just else want to, to farm. To we it. want to do what we... And we love it. We absolutely love it. Like, why can we not just do that? Why do we have yeah. to have another spin in it? Can we not just do this? Like, T- Totally. Yeah. You, uh, unfortunately for you, you're not really in a position to just do that. No. <laughs> like, you have that, to go and work off yeah. farm. Yeah. Oh, that's it. You just got to do what you have to do. Yeah. Like, you're a similar position to myself. All right, you're in a good tendency there. But you're still on a journey oh, to the that's not the end goal. Oh mm-hmm. my god, yeah. we're, we're still at the start. Like yeah. we're still mm-hmm. So we're how still... did getting that tendency come about? Oh yeah, we yeah. must have been on a tangent. Uh, yeah, <laughs> that was a long tangent though. Was. <laughs> that was about forty we've been minutes ago. <laughs> <We've been laughs> <laughs> Before it, I'm not gonna change the subject too much. Have you been to Cyprus? Never. No. Okay. Uh, have you lesson. been abroad? Yes. Oh she goes all, all apart from New Zealand. Uh, yes, been to New Zealand, been to Australia, Vietnam, and I'm off to Thailand at the end of this month. Uh, to find a t- oh, I was going to say something. <laughs> cut that, cut that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, don't say anything offensive on here. No, no. Uh, actually, <laughs> v- Vietnam is actually on my list. of. A, I'd love to go to Vietnam. Yeah. It's my favourite place yeah. I've ever been. I'd love to go see the bunkers. Yeah, They're still like, there. I just think it's, su- it's such an incredible story, the whole Vietnam War thing and how they won. I know. Yeah. <laughs> I think they did. Come on, I think we can all agree they did win. Like, it was quite amazing. Um, so, yeah, not be good to go and see. Do they sell it as they won? Did you do the tours? I didn't know. No, you know. just did filming mushrooms and all sorts of stuff. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's really me, Cammy. <laughs> filming <laughs> mushrooms. I wanted, that is the best bit of acting I've ever seen for you. That was class there. Her dad listens, so she got it. Oh, uh, so professional. That was so good. That was great. Yeah, that, that, that was good. Yeah, that yeah. was good. Yeah, tell us about it later. <laughs> uh, yeah. we'll, we'll hear about it later. <laughs> so, sorry, I want to uh, get back to I will not uh, interrupt again. Okay. And then. what you do in your own time is your business. <laughs> 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 did see the sign outside for the mushroom farming 
<laughs> industrial stadium. <laughs> yeah, UV lights up the stairs. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's why the dodgy wiring is around there. <laughs> this, this is the only office that doesn't have snow lying on the roof. <laughs> Wonder why. That's why everyone's always laughing. <laughs> 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 Aye, what was in that tea? Oh, yeah, what was in that? Take all my aches and pains away. <laughs> I feel great. I know, feel great. Right, Whenever I'm sitting in a box. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, what's happened? <laughs> <laughs> that was beautiful. Love it. Um, so you can ask him about this tent I'm either. desperate to hear about this tent yeah, this How did you get in the tent come about? Uh, so we'd been looking for a while. We'd actually yeah. only applied for one other farm. Yeah. What was the other one? And who got it? Uh, it was down in Lockerbie. Oh, mm -hmm. the Crown Estate yeah. one? Yes, that was a belter. But it was a really good farm. Oh, yeah. farm. Was, That's yeah. probably the best farm there's been some good ones in Butte as well, but yeah. that's probably one of the best farms that's been on the market, market for, for that kind of tenancy. Because yeah. that was oh, a yeah. 20 or yeah. 15? 15. 15. 15. Yeah, it was 15. Yeah. yeah. So, the yeah, big that in, was, there's, there's a lot of there's good, a lot. good able folk yeah. in for that. Oh, yeah, there was. it was serious, yeah. Yeah. Did, no, did you get down to an interview or? We were fifth. Yeah. We, were, we got fifth out of how many folks. Which so was, it was, was oh, actually a big boost for us because. Oh, totally. Because that was our first. That mm -hmm. was our first. The open farm viewing. Like we'd never been experiencing like that, like a proper open farm view where everyone that's interested is walking around that farm. Oh, I see you look, you're, you're, you're that's yeah. that's nodding. She'll actually know, oh, and then you know so many people yeah. as yeah. well. And you're like, oh my God, this yeah. is, you know. And like you... a lot of these things you try to keep kind of quiet for a while till, oh, till you know. Yeah, like, but then you once know, you're all there. Then when you're like, it. do the open farm viewing, it's just like everyone's there. Everyone, everyone knows, knows who's in for it. Yeah. Yeah. And then there is some people there that are not actually interested in getting it, but just want to go of water course. and farm. I, oh, that's of it. Course, just a lot. Yeah. Yeah. nosy round. I, like, I, I didn't even go and see that one. Because we, we're in a similar position to you. Yeah. We've yeah. got all the tenancies and that's stuff. That's it. But I honestly just thought at that point, that must be seven years ago now or more. Uh, yeah. No, less. We've only been the farm... Well, oh, yeah, I've only had sheep for eight years, so yeah, yeah, yeah four, definitely less. About four, it yeah, definitely less. Four, sorry. five years. So, so yeah, four or five years ago, mm -hmm. and I just thought, oh, I'm not fit for this. I know. Like, I was like, I, you're going to need deep pockets. Or, oh, you do. Or certainly the ability to buy a lot of stock. Yeah, Because you need definitely. a lot of cattle and sheep, and I thought, yeah. and then machinery, and I thought, mm, it's a lot. I'm it's not fit going for to, this. Yeah. So you tried that one, didn't get it? Yep. And then we just kept looking, yeah, looking we looked for a while. Looked at a couple that just we didn't even put in for after no, we looked them. They just yeah. didn't suit us. Just okay. not just what we wanted to do, mm -hmm. um, or what you would have to do on it wasn't going to suit us. And then just happened to flip through the Scottish Farmer, seen the smallest advert I've ever seen for a tenancy farm in the Scottish Farmer, and went for a wee nosy and then really, really liked it. Mm -hmm. uh, I just, it was just a tiny wee bit. I remember yeah. seeing it in the paper. Yeah, yeah, yeah. it was tiny. It didn't, no pictures, me, just... To me, it almost read like uh, like just a piece of ground. Yeah. Mm. Like it was such uh, a small yeah. ad. Really? Because yeah. 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 someone a sent me a photo of it. Yeah. Um, and, and when I first read it, I thought it just... It just sounds like a bit of, like, bit of ground, yeah. 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 I never went to see that one at all yeah. or even looked at it because mm. I think when I looked at the ad, it just kind of... Uh, it wasn't probably like you say, it just put me off. I was like... Ah, you're like, what is this? Yeah. But there you go. Yeah. So, yeah, and then went in front of him. Yeah, got it. What were you like it. when you got it? Oh, Rachel. honestly, well, I, well, I was away. I was laying concrete. Are in you in laying a shed. concrete? I, must and I kept getting his phone calls and I need to answer this and I need to wait for the next load to finish before you can start Because I was on the phone it. to you yeah. and then they were obviously trying to phone you and then you must have hung up on me and I was like, why is he hung up on me? And I kept trying to phone him and phone him and phone him and like 10 minutes later you phone back. He was like, do you want the good news? I was like, what are you talking about? <laughs> And then he, he said that we got it, and I was like, "What? No, you're taking the piss!" Like this, you're yeah. No but no, it was it was the best feeling, like because we did, yeah. we genuinely did put so much work into ourselves. Like we did all the business plan. We went through, we went through every single figure, absolutely everything. We put our heart and soul into it. Yeah. Um. So I think even if we didn't get it, even if we just got to an interview, I think we still would have been pleased yeah. because we know that we done it because you get like there's a loads of different folk that do your business plans that are brilliant mm -hmm. um, but we thought for this one we'll just try it ourselves put into yeah. it what, what, yeah. we, what we think and I thought well if we if we don't get any further than that at least they've appreciate what, we, what we've put into it so it was it was such a boost yeah, yeah. easiest yeah. concrete floor I've ever laid in my life oh, yeah, <laughs> after, after that, that. Oh. Yeah, just floating above it. Yeah. Yeah. It was like I was on mushrooms. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Not that know anything about that. Because there's, there's so few tenancies that yeah. come available, and I think mm. that's the hardest thing. Like, for young folk wanting to get in, is there's so few opportunities. So we just yeah. grabbed grabbed what we could when we could. So. And how long do you have left? Um, so we're two years in. We've got another three 
three. Yeah. And, so, and is, there must there be a clause that when does it renew? That like it can't get right down to zero? No. Yeah, no, it, you, aye. So it yeah, renews, within last uh, year. Within last year. So you okay. can renew or do what? And it'll right. just be five again every time? Yeah. As far as you yeah, know? Yeah. It, as far as we know, it'll be it'll be rolling like that. So. Okay, that's, yeah. that, that's interesting. Yeah, yeah no, the, 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 the long-term tenancy thing... You know, you don't get these secure tenancies anymore. Mm. No. Probably doesn't know what a secure tenancy is. A secure tenancy is essentially like it's a it stays with the it's a hereditary thing, mm. so it can stay with the family. So the father or mother can pass it to the son or daughter, and and it passes through the family. And it's secure. It's yours for as mm. long as you want it, basically. Yeah. And like the old school ones were generally in a very favourable rate. Yeah, yeah definitely. Like, oh, oh, yeah. Definitely. Some of the tenancies oh. are frightening. Like, I know. Absolutely frightening. Um. But it was a different time, and that's it. Uh, you know, it's that's, yeah. just yeah. That that's how it is. But the problem is, well, not the problem. Any of these come out now; they're generally taken back by the yeah. the owner, whoever owns the farm, and some of them are leased out again. Some of them are sold. Yeah, mm. uh, there's various things happen. Some waiting to see what's happening with the carbon th carbon mm. yeah. credit that's thing. Just, mm -hmm. But you just don't get anyone now that will commit to. 20 years no, and I think it all comes yeah. down to apart, money as well apart from Crown Estates and, yeah. and then oh, I've got to give a shout to like Butte yeah. uh, oh yes. definitely oh, they've been very good is it Mount Short Trust I think is the, the landlord yes on Butte so they're quite good they do 20 year tenancies which yeah. is so rare mm -hmm. and then Crown Estate of course which is the Crown uh, do them as well which is, is great as well but apart from that like, you just don't yeah. no. no I think it's all it all yeah. comes down to money yeah. and it's sad it's sad to say but it does all come down to money because a lot of these big estates and stuff and landowners mm -hmm. they're thinking well those farmers have paid next next like pennies compared to what people have to pay now mm -hmm. for ground. Yes. Yeah. They think, well, if I give them a long term tenancy, what's gonna happen in twenty years time when there's gonna be even less ground mm -hmm. to farm because it's planted and yep. stuff like that. So they're not wanting to tie down for too long because they know that all these what? the price of your uh, tenancy and stuff can increase when mm -hmm. it gets to the end of these short term tenancies. Yeah, yeah and, and I suppose that what Another factor is the fact that, you know, £10,000 today isn't £10,000 in 10 years' time. Yeah. yeah and that's, yeah, that's part of the reason why now we look at these secure tenancies and yeah. what they're paying, and it looks so ridiculous to us. Yeah. yeah. But at the time, it was a lot more money. Yeah, yes. of course mm -hmm. it would have been. It's just over the years. It's, yeah. it's all gone. Yeah. It, it's dropped and dropped and dropped. Yeah. Uh, and now it doesn't seem like a lot of money. But, you know, we saw, there's got to be some wins in farming. Yeah, oh, yeah. That, that's oh, it. Definitely. That's got to have it. Some wins. But listen, I know you have got to get on. We're, we're over the hour mark there. <laughs> um, it's been a fantastic chat. Is there anything that I own, anything we're missing that we, should, we haven't asked? No, but I do think we should start asking everybody the same question at the end. Do you have one? Um. <laughs> <laughs> Just that, no. What, uh, what do you think the biggest challenge is for farmers? And what do you think is the biggest positive of being a farmer? I see we should, uh, right, and we'll need to, in future, tell them it before we come so that they can prepare their answer yeah. for the statement. Yeah, 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 yeah but no, but, no, but like, have a go. On the it. spot, Rach, what's your what's, answer? What's, you the, go what's the biggest challenge? Um, for us at the moment, probably just the cost of everything. Like, everything's just so kind of up and down. Like, mm -hmm. you're not, like, from what we had planned in our business plan, I don't know anybody that could actually stick to that to the T because everything changes so much. Yeah. So it's just tractors a prime example. Oh, like just your so yeah. We machine. price tractors and stuff for the first uh, for the first one the farm went at Lockerbie. We priced tractors mm -hmm. for that, and then within those two years, the price of tractors rocketed, went through the roof. Yeah. Export yeah. value and stuff like that. So then you like you don't realize you could be paying seventeen thousand for just a older tractor to you mm. could be paying twenty seven thousand uh, in the yeah. space of yeah. two years. For the same tractor that's got more hours on it, but still the same one that you priced two years before that. Yeah. 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 And probably like the control thing, like with stock and stuff, like you've just like your best, yeah, your best cow could just die on you mm -hmm. and like you've just got yeah. no control over that. And that's always like hard. You've just got to be constantly kind of juggling these things. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. And, and a big thing for like guys like yourself that's starting out and like us as well. Yeah. And, and it certainly is true for us is it's hard to get ahead when you're just trying to survive. Oh, yes. honestly, oh, genuinely, when you're just trying to you're just, just trying to make enough money to yeah, pay the rent. Uh -huh, yeah. that's it. That is genuinely it's it. It's hard you're to then think ahead of how we're going to build. Oh, definitely, and that's mm -hmm. it. And we're at the stage where we need to build too, but as you say, you're just at that, you're at that crucial line where you think, well, we're just trying to, yeah. trying to push it to yeah. that, which mm -hmm. is, which is, it's a, it is a really daunting thing, like, but you've got to be, 
You've got to love it. You've got to yeah. absolutely yeah. love it. And why do you love it? What's the best? Um, oh, why do I love it? I could be here all day. Um, She'll start crying in a minute. <laughs> no. <laughs> she gets no, emotional I'm not over these things. I, I don't, but no, just because we're doing, I think we're lucky that we've both got the same ambitions. Like we both mm-hmm. want to do, we both want to do this. It's not as if, well, I've just come into your life and this is what you want to do. We both are so passionate about it. Mm-hmm. And just expand and just do what we love. Like I love, like the thought of just going out in the morning and like just looking at the farm and think this is ours. Like yeah. this is, what we, this is yeah. what we want to do. Like this is what we love doing. Like as hard as the hard days are, like you've just got to just take a step back. Like at the end like, of the day, we're building to hopefully give our future family an easier life. Yeah, that's yeah. it. Is, yeah. Like, that's yeah. what yeah. I look at that, all the time. That. You want to leave them something that oh, there's, that's it. Yeah. there's no debt. That's they it. Just, they, can, they can step into it. Yeah. yeah. And if they don't want to do it, that's fine. That's it. There's, yeah. But, well, give them. <laughs> they'll be pushed, a wee but, nudge. <laughs> yeah. But no, just no. to be able to leave something that's. So you've nice. built, that, that, that you've built, built from scratch. Yeah, that's that, it. That could be a topic for our next uh, Q and A, actually, because we, we should go into that too. I've got a couple of things I want to talk about. But one, one, um, I worry that my boys will be too spoiled, mm. and it will make them soft. Yeah, like you're saying, it's good for the next generation. Yeah, but, right? but then yeah, it's like, where's it's the to- fight? Aha, uh-huh, that's it. You know, where's yeah, the hunger? But then you push the them to their but own I think thing. it'll always be hard. I for us, yeah, definitely. Yeah. Uh, then yeah. you can push them to their own thing, but right? They might want to do their own podcast. But we'll save that for a midweek. We'll have a debate yeah. about how you keep the kids hardy. Yeah, that's oh, definitely. Because yeah. because that's keep my worry. Keep, my my pet hate is iPads. You know, yeah, that's, that, you sound like somebody that doesn't have kids. <laughs> I don't <laughs> have kids. I actually don't have kids, but yeah. we've got nieces and nephews, and we've got our whole friend group. We've all got kids now. Yeah. We were the last ones to get married. Yeah, um, but. It's iPads. I hate kids with iPads. Like, just let them go out and play with toys. Yeah. I, because I, all I, kids I, want to do is Lizzie go and watch I said an iPad. That at first, Lizzie yeah, and I said all that. Paint does, we but said all just, that. No but, TV. All, yeah. You know, let's... But, but when you need to go on and do jobs... It's like, see when Lizzie's yeah. herself with the two boys and oh, she needs to, like, needs go to and do, do something. something. She just, just give just, them that reprieve. Just leave them the, if I have to leave them in the car for 10 minutes or That's 20 minutes or two hours. Peppa Pig, he's got, like, an unbreakable Amazon thing. Yeah. Stick Peppa Pig on. He sits there and they bother. He's not going to grab something to shoot. He just sits there, doesn't get yourself in a panic. That's it. You can go and do it. That's you know, it. we were all the same. Oh, yeah. We should do a follow-up. Like, once he's got oh, kids. you've got kids. Uh-huh. Yeah. And then he's like, well, how's that whole iPad thing going? Kind of, Sit out there and play on your iPad. I'm doing <laughs> <Yeah>. a podcast. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. I don't, I don't want to hear it. Don't you dare come to this door till I come out. <laughs> um, no, uh, that's, that, that is a good point and it is something to think about. I think, no, it, I think I we thought all those great things that we do, do and then you get there and it's like... When you just need and now you've got a you third do, one on the way. Get, Same now, get, exactly. That's it, when you've it, we, got, we just put the TV on if need be. That's mm-hmm. it. When like you need to go on with things. You've, yeah. got, you've got to. You know, everyone's working. Like everyone needs a. If you keep yeah. going, you'll need to build a cinema room for all these wains. Yeah, it's uh, mm. yeah. Lizzie's got grand ambitions. I think oh. football team. <laughs> Invest in a minibus. <laughs> I can't get a minibus. <laughs> Handily, yeah. I've got. We we'll have got two shearing trailers, so we can get five out. <laughs> that's, that's 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 it all, and that's you, there's your ambition. You wonder what their ambition was going to be. Their ambition was to be to have a full family run, two run trailers, rouses, yeah, everything, yeah, all, all from the all from the team. Yeah, well, you never know. Make a good photo if nothing else. Yeah, make, nah, yeah. Make, make a nice <laughs> cover photo from my nah, Facebook. Yeah. <laughs> Me and the boys. I'm like, boys, I know you hate it and you're a spoiled wee brats, but just stand up just, for a photo. I know, just get the photo. Put the iPad down for one minute. Just, just <laughs> aye. It's like, David Cammy does just sheer one for the photo. And then that'll do. That's it. I, that yeah, was, that, I was actually talking about sheer. I was annoyed. I yeah. spent, we done uh, filming a lot of sheer. Mm. Of me right. sheer our own mm. sheep. Because we sheer everyone, save aye, cost. Yeah, yeah. Aye, uh, we get friends in every now and again, jump on their stand. So we've got our own sheer and trailer. And uh, went and sheared all the sheep and they filmed it all never used it because they obviously don't like to use stuff that another family's doing so if mm. someone's far mm. shearing they're not really going to use your shearing one yeah. 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 and I was like yeah. it was so good it was the tidiest I've ever shared as well. yeah. and it was so quick for a change and it makes you look so macho and all yeah. that yeah. yeah, and they never used it. Have you requested yeah. the footage? No, I was thinking about it. Like, <laughs> just see what it's like. Aye, aye, you see what it's actually like, like Cammy. You're like, yeah, you can't even show this. <laughs> just to share on Facebook. Cammy's yeah. absolutely panting in the background, trying to keep going. Cut this, cut this. <laughs> <laughs> Um, Next one. I know. <laughs> hey, when the midges come out, just hold this don't. I know. Leave, leave me twos. Leave me twos. <laughs> when the midges come out, see if there's a sheer and smoker. They're all shit. Keep yeah. buffing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Absolutely. But, oh, and just when I've got you on, 
when you want to come scan, saves the question and <laughs> yes, so there's, someone did got made a, we've had a second email into the podcast about what do you have to do to get me to reply to WhatsApps. Um, but yes, February will be all right. Yeah, we'll sort it, mate. I'll, I'll do I'll do it all over Christmas. You know what I'm like. <laughs> I sort it out the Christmas. Aye, aye, aye. Text me the week before and I'll squeeze right. in somewhere. So that's what I usually do. But no, That's that'll it. be grand. Well, listen, it's, it's been great to have you on. No, uh, thanks for having us. Having us. It, it's been nice, easy conversation. Mm-hmm. Hopefully you guys listening at home have enjoyed it as well. Mm-hmm. Uh, so I should do my final closing thing, which is that uh, thanks very much for listening. I've been Cami. I've been Iona. And we are both fed, fed by, by farmers. farmers. <laughs> Slack on it. Oh, oh, serious. Yes. <laughs> <laughs>